Brady, first of all, I mean, you know, you look at your career overall, and you're a multiple sport guy. You're a basketball guy. You're a baseball guy. This season, can you sum it up any other way other than just relentless with you guys? I mean, you know, you just kept getting better each year, and now finally it's paying off with an opportunity. Yeah, I mean, we didn't start the season the way we wanted to in the section. Dropped a couple early, a couple ugly ones, but it's the learning curves. We've got a decently veteran group with me, Nate, Waz, but there's also some younger guys learning more and stepping up, but we're peaking at the right time, and those guys are getting more and more involved. I'm glad you said that because your team chemistry is outstanding. I mean, you see it out on the court with all you guys. You see it in the school as Absolutely. well, and that's such an important thing. And, and, and that's what it seems like. I mean, you came in tonight averaging less than 10 points a game, but it's the little things that you do, all the things, the assists, the steals, all that, that kind of stuff, that unselfish stuff that Coach was talking about that really has the team chemistry going so well for you. Yes, sir. We're a tight group. You said in school, we're always together. Practice, after practice, go out to eat, play a little basketball on, the, on, our, on our own time. Sure. But we're close group and it definitely helps on the court too coach mentioned a lot of the injuries you know your your wrist is taped up your hand you had the shin splints and everything nothing would keep you from playing and i know him and i have conversations in the school every day about it um but uh you're one tough kid and and i know you want to do that for the team and just just to keep doing that i mean what's your regimen what do you do to to, to stay well, uh, half healthy <laughs> three or four ice baths a day in the whirlpool with tt <laughs> And I go home and take some ice baths, but uh, senior season, not really much is going to keep me off the court. I love these guys. I love playing with them. So I'm not sure that I could tear my ACL right now and you could get me off the court. Absolutely. I love these guys so much. Absolutely. Well, you're so much fun to watch. I'm looking forward to you playing baseball, but you have a while before that happens because you, you have some work to do on the yeah. basketball court yeah. uh, first before that. So thank you so much, Brady. I appreciate it. I appreciate you. Absolutely. You're, hey, good athlete better person Thank that's you. the key but i Thank appreciate you. it and there's another one right there 23 my favorite number by the way i just have to say but uh nate papuga joining us nate first of all i know today i said to you that i might be talking to you tonight and if i do we're going to talk about your thousand points and i know you said to me you want to talk about the team first and what the team has been able to accomplish talk about your season with these guys uh it's gone really great from the start of the season even beyond that back in the summer whenever we all came together we were either at my house in Blairsville in this gym. We were just all together all the time. Working hard and, and getting ready to go. You're the big scorer on the team, obviously. You know, they, they look to you to make the plays, but at the same time, you know, and again, I'll use the word unselfish because it's true, what you need to do as a basketball team to get to that next level. What do you think this team needs to do in the playoffs to win a playoff game and to propel you to the next round? Just continue to be unselfish and take what the defense gives us same with on defense just we have to execute well in whatever we do 42 points tonight how many threes coach huh five was it five i'm putting you on the spot 40 40 40 42 points on the night and uh you know for the season 1080 whatever whatever it is and when you look at the scoring and you look at the people that you're around in that scoring. A guy like Ryan DeMary, who was watching this game tonight, watching you because he's very proud of what you did. Uh, a guy like Stan Falinski, who my dad used to talk about years ago, how good of a player he was. Uh, somebody that you probably didn't know, but uh, Louis McCracken, you know the McCracken family. Danny Shaw, Mr. Shaw was here watching you play tonight. And for you to, to eclipse that mark and be there with those people, man, you have to feel so proud of yourself and, and, and what you've been able to accomplish. Yeah, we, I've come a long way as a player from sixth grade whenever I started to now, and I couldn't have done it without my teammates. Yep, and, and all the work you have to put in too, right? Yeah, of And it's, it, it, it's crazy because Brady and Nate, and I know I've said this to you guys years ago in baseball and coach, I'm sure, there are so many kids around here, and it was youth basketball night here tonight, that look up to you guys. But it's how you carry yourself, not only on the court, but in the classroom and everything else that makes a difference. And those kids are really looking at you like you're superheroes. And that's really cool because I'm sure you guys had superheroes too when you guys were growing up. And I mean, to see you guys do that really gives me goosebumps and I know coach as well. But congratulations on really two hell of a careers between both of you guys, absolutely. Thank so congratulations. You. Thank you very Thank much. You. Absolutely, thank you. Appreciate it, guys. And good luck in the playoffs. Thank you.